Okay, so we want to draw the structure of PCL5. In order to do that, we are going to find out the hybridization of PCL5. So, as you guys know that phosphorus has five valence electrons plus chlorine. Chlorine has seven valence electrons, right? But we have five atoms of chlorine, so we are going to divide seven by five, okay? Which comes out as 40. Now, this value 40 is greater than 8. If it would have been 8, 6, uh, 4 or 2, then we would have divided it by 8. But since 40 is a greater number than 8, we are going to divide it, divide it by 8, okay? So, 40 by 8, sorry, by 8 is equal to, I'm sorry, yeah, is equal to 5, right? So, uh, this 5 corresponds to sp3 dehybridization, okay? sp3 dehybridization. So, now we know the structure of PCL5, which is sp3d. And this sp3d mean, means that it is uh, trigonal bipyramidal, right? Now we are going to write the central atom P, which is phosphorus, okay? And a triangle having Cl, Cl and Cl. And this is a triangle and we are talking about triangular bipyramidal, okay? So one Cl will be above this plane okay and one cl will be below this plane okay so this is the structure of pcl5 now i'll try to uh, draw a more comprehensive diagram of pcl5 so that you get a better conception of the structure Okay, see, what happens is that this is phosphorus, sorry, let me draw a little better one, yeah, okay, the corners are represented by chlorine, okay, chlorine, chlorine and chlorine, the three bonds, right, and the sec the th uh, the fourth chlorine here and fifth chlorine here now what i'm talking about is if if uh, if we got sp3 dehybridization that it means it is trigonal bipyramidal right so yeah connected like this now where are the uh, pyramids let me draw it did you see this the black one the, this is uh, the first phase of the pyramid this is a face of a pyramid this is the second phase of the pyramid and this is the third phase of the pyramid yeah and just like that there will be a pillow below this triangle plane okay so like this here and another work one coming from here okay so you've got a triangle okay and you've got one pyramid and you've got the second pyramid okay so this was the actual structure of pcl5 which is triagonal by pyramidal. I hope you liked this video and if you did uh, then please subscribe it is my humble request and I'll see you guys again with another video very soon thank you and have a happy reading